Boy, this is a shocker. Many New Mexicans are going to have to find somebody else to wake up to in the morning. The long-running Tony Lynn and Miles radio show on Big Eye 107.9 every morning was canceled without warning today. Here's News 13's Kim Vias. The Big Eye 1079 studio now sits quiet. For 11 years, it's been filled with the chatter of Tony Lynn and Miles. Hey, brand new feature coming up at 6 o'clock this morning. Their stories and antics made people laugh. Thousands woke up to them every day. But this morning, the pair found out today's was their last show. It was a nice family, so yeah, you're gonna miss all that. You know, it's good. I'm not gonna miss. Well, I will miss getting up at 3:15. You know, but what are you gonna do? Clear Channel execs say it was a business decision based on ratings and revenue. We had some initial great success, uh, but frankly, over the last two years, it's been declining, and it was time that. You know, I have to make a decision based on the fiscal responsibility to this company. Tony and Miles created the Big Eye 1079 back in 2000. Before that, Tony was the main guy on KRST's morning show. Miles started there as an intern, but his quirky stunts helped make him a main attraction. We had a great time together. You know, it was, it was, he's a good kid. We met up with Tony shortly after today's announcement at one of his favorite places. So, what's next for him? We've been here for 21 years. It's been good. New Mexico has been good to us. You know, my wife and I have had a gr great time here. Whether we stay or not, I, you know, it's, we'll see. But uh, it's up in the air right now, obviously. You know, we're just gathering our thoughts. But Tony says he is going to miss his listeners. The listeners were just outstanding. You know, I'm going to miss a lot of the people, a lot of the phone calls that we, we got every day. You know, we, we got to know people by, uh, by their voice as much as they knew us by our voice. Kim Vias, KRQE News 13. We got a hold of Miles late today. He said he just wanted to thank all of those listeners and to say that he is looking forward to his next adventure. Clear Channel has not said who will replace them.